Hello there, Golfreak here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civ 5 as China. Uh, where we last left off, we were just pretty much just focusing on our uh, economic and science, and basically everything besides the military, though we are still kind of picking up the military a little bit. Um, I'm thinking of a possible war with uh, Babylon. But honestly, I don't think it's going to happen unless I really am able to buff up my military, probably after I get all the way up to Rifleman. And then just start taking him out, because I should be able to walk all over him at that point. So long as my science uh, remains in the top. And I eventually should run out of things to build, too, for buildings and stuff in my capital. Hey, Dr. Policy, so we can go down Piety, or we can go down Freedom, because both of them will give me basically more, uh... For, uh, more culture. Plus two culture for each world wonder, which is pretty good. Eight units are maintenance free, which is actually not that bad. The freedom isn't really that appealing to me. Um, that happiness is great. That is pretty nice as well. That is also really good. Because it's 33% for each wonder. And immediately enters a golden age. Yeah, this, this branch is much, much, much more appealing to me. Because it gives me way more culture. So yes, we want this branch. And we got 19 turns to my next policy, which is fine. That's not that's not bad at all, considering I have what six six cities. I got 26 happiness, and I'm going strong. It's looking good. See, I have 30 strength. What are his city strengths? Yeah, his city strengths are right up with mine. So when it comes to that, we're basic. And like this city's 20, 20, 40, yeah. It's because my capital, I've got the uh, Kremlin there. Does defense count on size too? I'll we'll see if this grows and like my defense goes up, then that is a part of it. No. What exactly influences that? Is it the culture? I don't think so. It wasn't this before. It's like how much culture you have in the building is basically how much defense it has. Which is a little strange. Not bad, but we'll build that next. My golden age is almost over. Arrgh. I don't want it to be over. Don't stop. Don't stop. Okay, just build some more chukono. The chukono, because they're awesome. And heck, after I finish that, I'm probably not going to have anything to build in my capital. Except for units. So we're going to start going and pumping up military units. Stocking up my gold to upgrade them once they f get the full upgrade. Start building cannons as well. Okay, we're still looking very good when it comes to that, but we want this because this will give me a boost in production. Manufactory. Hopefully I spelled that right. I did not. Yeah, okay, let's just look at buildings. Well, let's look for. I can't spell. It sucks, but let's see. I spelled that wrong. No, I didn't spell that wrong. Fertilizer, military science, units unlock cannon. Yeah. Come on. Doesn't give me a click for it, I don't think. Tori. Tori. Oh, right. It's the, um... 
Right. Wait, it improves the resources. <gasps> oh, I see. So I can like stick like my great engineer on this and give it even more production than the. Oh, heck! I might have been wanting to do that then with all my stuff like for. Improves horses too. Wow. Yeah, I probably should have done that instead. Oh well. If I don't have anything to build with them now, I know what to do with them. I'll just use them to replace, like, iron works and uh, iron locations and stuff. Or if I find steel or something, who knows? Dum de dum dum. I still see a lot of unrenovated territory around my cities. Which is kind of weird. Opera house. definitely want that culture building in Beijing. Yeah, with the plan is just build the Chukono, then be able to upgrade them to riflemen, and then they'll be super powerful riflemen that can like take on anything. And it's too bad I don't have if I if I had the uh, the the uh, fountain of youth too that would be awesome. Okay, well we got a great artist, which is interesting. Um, the only one I'd really want to steal from would be Brussels, and we're allies with them, so I'm getting their stuff anyway. So I guess we could just expand them for a. Oh no, there is a marsh up here. I'll just pop them for a golden age, I think. I don't think there's anything else I really want, culture-wise. Yeah. Golden age. 12 turn golden age. Just help my production everywhere else. Let's just keep on pumping these guys out. Until I probably can't any longer. Okay, build the opera house. Dum da dum da dum da dum. Uh, just move to there, it's fine. Alert, choose production. Finish that, good. Now you just start pumping out units. We're, looking, we're really looking good, though. We've got a heck of a lot of gold per turn. We're... Wait a minute. What? Kilsicker to be 
trading punches with Babylon just because of over Brussels. Because I really like Brussels. Because I really want my culture. And this will give me what? Plus one production when dealing with. Should go with elephants too. Which is only like basically one extra. I'm not too keen on that. Let's build the bank here. You're actually making a decent amount of gold, so let's build a bank. So I want to make sure that the more money I have, it's like it's never a bad thing to have too much money. Because there's no inflation in this game. No. Oh, do you have. I have a resource. Doubt he'd go for that. Seems fair to me. No, it's not. Because I don't know why they don't allow you to do that, but it's kind of like it's no loss to him and it make me happy. And. There's just a lot of movement overall. Let's just keep on building uh, these units and just have a massive army. I have the money for it. Not that big a deal. And then I can maybe just go like on a war spree and just like taking capitals and such. And oh, I should build a uh, one of those things in here. One more you up here, and then we'll send all the rest down south. Because I'd probably just push like straight in for the capital, not worry about anything else. Just grab the cities along the way. Yeah. Wow, how do we not have chemistry? Looks like it should be a full bar. I'm coming because I want. I want a lot of these. Finish the windmill down here. Build the uh, opera house. Fertilizer. Just grew. How would Beijing do if I change its focus? 1062. Wait a minute. The default is less than everything except for gold and science. Heck no. I want that food and production here. It's ridiculous otherwise. And just get over there. That'll be more than enough of a force up there. Especially once they're upgraded. Throw some cans up there. Might just start pushing that way with that force. Might as well, right? I'm not going to have any buildings to build either, which is like really sweet because that means I'm just done and my built my con my economy and everything's like at max out while I'm building everything else. Which is like ideally what I would like. Now admittedly meeting everyone before I might go warmongering is not the world's best idea. But We'll see. We're gonna have fun with this. 
Righto, you can get targeting and you don't really need movement. You can just get targeting too. You can auto explore. You alert. There, wait. Probably turn the auto scrolling off because it's annoying as I'll get out. You go up there. You go up there. You're gonna come to here ish. Oh no, you just come to here. And you go there. You go there. Keep on building these guys. Um, should we have you build another caravel? I think we should have one more caravel. Hopefully they'll go different directions. I mean, you know, I am playing on a large map, so... We shall see. That could be a problem. I should be able to tech him out. Be able to out tech him. But I don't want to have to out tech him at this point. I want to be able to out just overall destroy him. Um, you can build me a bank. Yeah, just have you guys start piling it back here. So how many do we have? One, two, three, four. I want about ten down here. I'm gonna have about five cannons, if not more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Oh no, three more. Three. Yeah. You alert. So there's one. Coliseums wouldn't hurt. Let's actually build barracks here. Upgrade. Alert. 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 Unfortunately, I have two little melee units at the moment because I'm focusing on my ranged units because I want they're going to turn into uh, basically melee units. They're unranged ranged units. This is a city. I want to build the final Chukono. And that'll be enough. I can be content with what I have now. I think I can build the Hermitage, Hemorrhage, whatever. Words I cannot pronounce here. I think Nebuchadnezzar... Yeah, he's coming at me. There's like no way he's not. It's gonna get fun. So I'm probably just gonna stomp all over him if he does. Especially if I don't move. <laughs> um, can I build it? No, who doesn't have one? 
two required. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's build a uh, couple one one long swordsman just for good measure. And plus hap yeah, we want the happiness. In fact, I'm gonna go boom, 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 boom. That's probably what I'm gonna do. Hey, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Gives me a ton of happiness. And he's neutral. Yeah, they want stuff from me. They want to be friendly. They want to be friendly. I'm cool with that. I see one more melee unit, and I'll be perfectly fine down here. Golden Age is over. Okay, you're done with that. Build me a, an armory. Then I can just rush by units here if I wanted to. Ah, ha, ha. You'll pay for this some time. I figured that was coming. Russell has declared war on Helsinki. Helsinki has declared war on me. Now we meet Vienna. And they didn't even move to attack me? Now what? I don't understand why they did that at all. I'm like, I'm like, I'm becoming a military powerhouse and they decided to attack me. It's like, stupid! Out producing them like I'll get out. Um, shock, medic. So I will have some medics in the mix. Yeah, it's fine. I actually just come to here because I can move around to the units. Alert. So I'm, I'm gonna want to wait until I can get to the other stuff first. Forge wouldn't be bad, but no, we'll get the aqueduct. And we'll look at the tech tree because I need to go straight to rifling after. I get fertilizer. And then probably go to scientific theory after that. Just to keep up my science. Cue that up too. Come on, move forward with your units. I want to pulverize them. Okay, I think he can attack me there. But is he seriously just leaving me as trebuchet? I can just go wipe that out and that'd be worth a brains unit in my mind. Or a melee unit. Oh! Cool, we meet Genghis Khan. And you! Cool. I'll go to there. You come to here. You switch. Okay, why don't you just straight up attack him? Sure, in fact, it doesn't even say you'll wipe him out, which is actually not that bad. But this, if we do, see, if I do go and attack him, though, it will be hard for me uh, because of the Great Wall, so it won't be too, too easy. But we'll see, and I need to get some cannons down here as well. I really would rather not attack until after I get rifling. Which is why I'm going straight there. Upgrade you. Okay, let's build some more cannons. I figure about 10 cannons will be fine. More or less. Actually, that's a lot more than I'll probably need, but... 
I intend to be like super powerful here and just start wiping out city civilizations as they come at me. Whoa, he's got rifling. Nice. Yeah, Brussels, you're becoming quite nice. I like that. You're not very strong, like militarily. I don't think you'll take his cities, but fertilizers that'll help my cities grow. So that'll just overall help me. And we're next meeting, getting uh, metallurgy, which is good. The overall plan for now is basically just hold the fort. And I think we should push the line forward. If I have you... He no, have you here. Have you here. And start moving up. As long as all my range units are relatively near my uh, cultural borders, I'm cool with it. You just stay here. Do nothing. Do nothing. And we're going to push the front line right in front of his borders so I can get all my units over there. And I think we have enough opera houses now. So after I get the cannon out, we'll find out. Good, I can attack him. I'm, w I'm willing to go into his territory to do like hit and run guerrilla tactic type attacks. That's cool for me. Although, actually, I don't think I'll be able to do that from here, will I? Yeah, I won't be able to do that. But, I can do it next turn if I move to here. And he doesn't seem to have any defense, any units here. You seriously declare war on me? How, how, what is the... We're about as strong. Okay. So, yeah, I don't, not really up for that. I could probably still definitely win. It's not a matter of whether or not I'd win. I just don't really want to end up taking any kinds of losses either. Um, so we'll have a line, th a three-piece line right here. So you can move there. And you are done moving. You are done as well. You'll wait a turn. You're going to move up there. You're going to move across. You're going to move across. Finish the bank. Build the barracks. So I have a huge army and I'm still making 100 gold per turn. So yeah, I'm spending 73 gold on unit maintenance. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. this here. That'll give me another 20 culture. Actually, more than that, because it'll actually add 5 culture on top of the 50%, which is sweet. Uh, get barrage and siege. And get on down here. Eh, they moved him back further. Okay, well, we'll just kind of hit and... Oh, I can't even hit those guys. Jeez. for now. So there really isn't much I can do. Um, we'll... Well, actually, I can might as well just push all the way up to this point. Just so I can get all my units across my river. And then as soon as I can, just upgrade them. Or I can just start attacking, too. Question is, am I strong enough? I don't think I'm strong enough. But what the hey? We'll do it. We'll go in and just start attacking. If I don't think I can take the city, I can always pull back. 
Uh, do nothing. Do nothing. I was not expecting them to come from down there. Is the following trade yeah, we'll, of interest to you? We'll be friends with you. I'm not planning to go down south. I'm planning just to go to the right, maybe down to down right, but take over all of Europe. China's taking over all of Europe. If that's where I am, I think it is. Kind of funny. Okay. Well, we'll have you moving up against these trebuchets. You wait. Moving here. I want to just destroy, I think, is all of his units. Oh, it does take a movement, though, so that's something to note. <laughs> Look at that. Basically, it was two units right there. Just a very well strategically placed city. Oh wow! Yeah, that's bad. Um, move to there. 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 I'm probably gonna lose that pikeman now. Oh, hello. You aren't going anywhere. The same amount of attacks and whether or not I move that unit, so it doesn't really matter too much to me. Hey yo, great person born. We need you to the front lines. Okay, um, wow, we could just start pulling out units out of you too. Um, sure, should start building cannons for the heck of it. Hoping that they'll attack my pikemen. Funny thing to hope, but. Um. No, not yet. Not until I see like an actual threat. Oh, what? Where did you come from? Okay, I expected that. I might want to take that deal. I'm just not ready at this point. Oh, I was Brussels organized. Okay. Um. Raj. Siege. Let's get over here. Um. Actually, the best move might be asking for a city. Oh, well, we'll see. How much damage will I do? Okay, let's... Flat out destroy this one. This guy. I can range and move back. Good. Now, you two switch. And range. Right. 
Range. Range. Heh. And the funny thing is... That was really ridiculously easy to do. Wait, 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 wait. Mr. Cannon! Get over here. And do nothing. And from here I can attack the city as well. Um... I'd really actually rather wait how long until I can get, uh... It's thir okay, it's 13 turns from now. So you know what we're gonna do. Wait, you were gonna offer... That's... Is that really... What? Fine. Okay, well, you know what? Let's look at our demographics real quick. I was supposed to do it last turn, but I forgot. Um, soldiers, I'm in fourth place now, which is good. And I'm above average, which is also good. So I'm gonna cut the video off here, so thank you very much for watching. And yeah, God bless.